Okay, this is James P. Madonna from the uh, Facebook group Everything is Food. Uh, Mega Life 21 and Progressive Discussions. I am here at the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Okay, it happens to be August the 2nd. Yes, it is. I believe it is. Uh, Friday, August the 2nd, 2019. Yesterday was my birthday, so this is a post birthday lunch buffet special video okay now i'm going to take advantage of the scribe tie while it's still available look at a thick look at a thick succulent scribe tie all right we're going to do a little surf and turf commodore jeff sambello and i want to give a shout out to the star of the travel channels um hit show called Ghost Adventures. Uh, the one and only Exorcist Bishop Brian. All right. Get some nice scrub card filet. We're going to do, um, I don't know, surf and turf? Or surf and, uh, uh, or surf and surf. Well, I'm going to come back to this. This is interesting. Fettuccine, fettuccine Alfredo with shrimp. Uh, nah, I wouldn't say it's Alfredo, but it's pretty good. No Alfredo, but it's pretty good. Okay. Got the uh, lamb ribs coming out there. Lamb ribs. There you go. Got the bouillon base, whatever. Zupa de pêche. Looks pretty good. Here we have uh, the Prince of Mongolian Barbecue. The Vapors of Life. Look at that. Beautiful. There you go. Put some sauce on it. Now you're going to see the vapors of life getting kicked up. Look what we have here. We have um, something very artistic that is well worth a photograph. Okay, beautiful. beautiful work of art. Beautiful work of art. All right, now let me take advantage of this before they they totally massacre it. I think I think it might be a surf and surf. Brian and uh, Jeff Zambella. Well, the, the, the trick is to find meat instead of uh, fatty skin and bone, you know. Find some meat. There we go. The duck is out of luck. The duck is always good. The duck is always good. The duck is out of luck because uh, it's dead. Oh. But you know, Peking duck is very tasty too. Where the Chinese do. They got lamb ribs over there. It's tasty, but uh, a lot of fat on it. But it's oh, what the heck is this? Buffalo corn soup. What, the hell, what makes it buffalo? I have no idea. Okay, um, I have no idea. Jeff Samba, oh, look what they got here. Oh, wow, they got gyro, gyro meat. And there's the stuffed uh, chicken breast with spinach and cheese inside. Look at that. And look at that. Oh, I'll, I'll get to that later. Um, I guess it's going to be, okay, I got the surf and turf. I don't know if I have room for um, this gyro meat. Yeah, maybe I do. Uh, I'll go for some gyro meat with uh, my tomatoes. And then 
one slice of pita bread. All right, there's my carbs right there. And then, get some of this sauce. I think they call it the tzatziki sauce. All right. Well, it can't be a gyro in the shape of a sandwich, so it's gonna have to be like that. Because I have no choice, actually. Okay, here we go. For the very finest in buffalo chicken wings and hot wings for your next pre-planned sports event, come to Royal Habachi the Grill, Rule 46 West in Saddlebrook, New Jersey, and buy the chicken wings in bulk to go. The finest uh, hot buffalo chicken wings for your next sporting event. It could be any sporting event or pay-per-view. Doesn't matter what sport it is. Good, very good. Now I will, I will procure a steak. Oh, look at that, the ice cream is in good shape. Commodore Jeff Sambello. No, no fatty arbuckles messing it up. Look at that. No fatty arbuckles. Okay. And I will return to the seat. And I will, well, I gotta get lemons, actually. I gotta get, I gotta get some lemons. Let me go get lemons. Before I get lemons, Got to get a color-coordinated bowl. There you go. Color-coordinated bowl. Hopefully there will be lemons there. Oh, look at that. They got choice mangoes. Pineapple. Uh, mangoes look good. They look ripened. Hey, we got the shellfish covered. Ah, oh, good man, good man. Ah, bullshit. Oysters and shellfish can be hazardous to your health. Please eat at your own risk. We are not responsible for it. Ah, bunch of babies. Food allergies. You know what? People are so litigious nowadays. They're so sue happy that this is what happens. You have to post all these signs. Anyway, the seafood salad looks pretty good. Pretty jam packed, chocked with different fish. All right, very good. And the lemons are back, baby. The lemons are back. Nice big lemon wedges are back for my refreshing lemon, iced lemon water, and for the codfish, you know. Okay, Chase Pima done, I'm back. Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddle Brook, New Jersey. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Just got an idea. So I'm gonna take some of this. Even though I'm really not a fan of white semolina flour pasta, I'm gonna take some of this. Um, shrimp flavored, it's actually shrimp flavored linguine. It's not fettuccine. It's not Alfredo and it's not fettuccine. But that's okay. That's all right. This is what I'm going to do. This is I'm going to take some of this. All right. And of course, it can't be al dente because it's um, it's been sitting here. And then I'm going to get some of this uh, calamari. Mussels and shrimp. 
And I'm going to put this right over the uh, linguine. Facebook food. I got like almost, I think almost 2,000 members now. And uh, the guy from the Ghost Adventures, the Exorcist Bishop, yeah, he, he likes my my videos. Yeah, I talk to him a lot. The guy that does Exorcist on the Travel Channel. So I just got an idea. I mean, I don't usually eat white pasta. I like whole wheat, but. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm doing that. Okay, it says fettuccine with shrimp. Alfredo, it's not Alfredo, it's not fettuccine. That's all right. Oh, that's, that's on the video, oh my God. I reveal the truth. This guy have a, oh, not in the video here. This is the most diet, this is the most diet friendly Mongolian barbecue of all. There's nothing there. Zero calories except for some grease. Got that? All right. All right. Okay. Now, I will return with, oh, you know what I gotta go get? I gotta get some Parmesan cheese. And I know exactly where to find it. What happened? She she moved my glass. What's going on here? She moved my glass. Or did I move the glass? Okay. Oh, the mangoes are still there. Who knows? Just maybe they will be there when I'm ready for them. Get some Parmesan cheese. We smell it to make sure it is Parmesan cheese and not uh, sawdust or, or pulver pulverized wax. No, it is. It's real. Hey, how you doing? Friday man. Friday man. <laughs> uh, unless, unless I have a, a, a guest coming, like my friend's coming from Canada uh -huh. to do. He does athletic competition. He's gonna, he's gonna say, I want to go to Royal Hibachi okay. every day. He likes it here. Yeah. Mr. Jeff Sambello, Commodore Jeff Sambello. Yes. There is a Sichi Young Man. Okay. All right. A little Parmesan there. Parmesan or is it Parmesan? Parmesan or Parmesan? How do you say it? Whatever. Got it. Otherwise known as uh, linguine with dandruff. Fruit de Damar. Beautiful. Got mussels here, calamari, shrimp, the broth of the sea. All right, it's time for mangoes. And this time they're not, it's not the hairy pit in the middle. They look ripened. Especially the orangey ones. 
like a wet labia. What do you think, Commodore Gypsy and Bella? Succulent mango, very high in nutrition. Possibly the, the second most nutritious fruit on the planet. I think papaya was voted number one. I mean, for overall nutritional value. I need some vitamins. As Papa used to say, I need some vitamins. I need some. Ooh, should I get some? Maybe I'll get a couple of strawberries. Maybe I'll get, maybe I'll get more than a couple of strawberries. Is that designer ice cream sauce? I have no idea what the hell designer ice cream sauce means, but that's what it says. This is excellent, by the way. The Turkish salad, very good. Commodore Jeff Sambello. Of course, I'm going to use a regular spoon. Of course, you know the reason why. Right? I don't have to tell you. I'm going to get some chocolate chip mint because it is hot weather we've been having, hazy, hot, and humid. And this is a very refreshing flavor for the summer. Manager here is a little moody. She's not presenting a greeting to James P. Madonna. I still can't figure out what the hell designer sauce is. I don't know. I have no idea what designer sauce means. Good old ice cream. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.